Welcome to another demonstration of Bitdefender's end-to-end -end breach avoidance platform. We're looking once again at Hypervisor Introspection, a unique Bitdefender exclusive defense that focuses on memory manipulation attack techniques visible only at the hypervisor level. HVI is purpose-built to identify and stop zero-day malware as easily as any existing exploit. And this is done completely a priori and without any advance notice of either the vulnerability or the specific exploit built to take advantage of that vulnerability in the wild. Today's subject is CVE 2020-0796, also known as Eternal Darkness, the latest in a series of vulnerabilities affecting the Microsoft Server Message Block Protocol, which was first reported in March of 2020. Eternal Darkness continues the very powerful and effective lineage of well-known SMB exploits like Configure in 2008 and Eternal Blue in 2017, which spawned WannaCry and NotPetya. Eternal Darkness is a wormable remote code execution exploit that specifically targets Microsoft SMB version 3, and it affects both Windows servers and Windows clients. Security researchers at Bitdefender Labs have obtained samples of Eternal Darkness from the wild that utilize this exploit to perform remote code injection from a standard user account, resulting in a command prompt shell with elevated administrative privileges a vantage point from which the attacker can then assert effective control over the victim machine. Now let's watch Bitdefender's hypervisor introspection in action against the eternal darkness exploit of CVE 2020-0796. First, a little bit about our environment. We have Bitdefender's Gravity Zone Management Console provisioned with our hypervisor introspection security virtual appliance deployed inside Citrix hypervisor along with a supplemental pack on the host. We're using an unpatched standard installation of Windows 10 virtual machine running under Citrix, a system that is completely vulnerable to the eternal darkness exploit. And critically, we're running absolutely no local anti-malware protection inside the guest operating system. Gravity Zone has visibility into the existence of this system via automated virtual machine inventory provisioning integration with Citrix, but note that the VM we're looking at here is completely unmanaged and unsecured in any way, with no protective security policies applied. Over in the Citrix Zen Center client, we take a look inside the running VM, and we can see here that no security tools are running on this Windows 10 system. Now we can demonstrate the exploit. First, we open a command prompt window and ask for the current user using the who am I command. We see that we're currently running as a standard user on the system without administrative privileges. Now we run the exploit code, which immediately spawns another command prompt window. Running who am I again, we now see that the user has changed and the privileges have been elevated to NT authority, an admin user with wide ranging access to protected Windows systems functions. Clearly, the exploit was successful on this unprotected Windows machine. Next, we'll enable Bitdefender hypervisor introspection protection simply by applying an HVI policy to the running VM in Gravity Zone. No restart needed. The HVI protection is applied on the fly, and it looks at the memory space from outside of the VM at the hypervisor level. Absolutely no signature, behavioral, or static analysis protective techniques are being applied here, only HVI. Now, back inside the exact same running Windows 10 VM, inside the very same command prompt as before, we rerun the exploit code and we now see that the exploit has failed without deploying anything at all inside the guest OS. In the Gravity Zone console, we can immediately see that this time the code injection exploit attempt failed. The malicious code targeting the win logon process was denied, stopped cold in its tracks because HVI prevented it implicitly, operating from within the hypervisor memory space. And that's all there is to it. HVI delivers immediate, transparent protection against a zero-day remote code injection exploit from the unique vantage point of the hypervisor memory space. Thank you for watching Hypervisor Introspection in action, and make sure to catch us on our next installment of Bitdefender end-to-end -end breach avoidance.